Hey guys, hi, and uh, this time I am here to start another tutorial series of reinforcement learning analogy. And as you can see here, today in this very first lecture, I am going to start from a very basic program that how to teach a taxi to pick, a, pick and drop off passenger at the right location with the help of reinforcement learning. This is an example how we train uh, randomly to an agent and how it perform. Uh, while we perform it randomly, it uh, there is almost 510 penalties occur and it takes total steps time taken is 1562. Though at this moment I know these terms, these terms sounds you weird because you are not familiar with these terms. What is action, reward, policy, state, agent? So uh, let's start from the very basic things and I'm using in this program the epsilon greedy method to train our agent with okay and in the following in the next following series what you will learn you will learn more about and more practical application of reinforcement learning and how you would be able to train your own agent and okay here guys without wasting any time let me give you a quick overview of theoretical and then I'll move for the practical implementation using Jim environment. Jim is a very powerful environment provided by the open AI and now everybody can access reinforcement learning, play, build the program on the top of it. Okay guys, so here I'm giving you an example of reinforcement learning on analogy by taking a horse standing example where the horse is being trained for obstacle race okay i hope you guys are already familiar with obstacle race if not then let me open an obstacle race picture for you okay here are some images let me give you a perfect example you know obstacle race is something like that here let's say you are you are the jockey jockey and the horse is the agent okay you are training the horse and whenever the horse successfully pass the obstacle you actually pet him and it get rewarded while if it fails in the reverse you whip him the horse is being whipped by jockey and uh, it get penalty while in uh, while if in the successful try, the horse keeps, passes the obstacle and finally it wins the race or or, or, or in the reverse, it uh, fails on and at any obstacle and start again. So if keeping this as an example of horse training race obstacle, imagine that I'm giving you an overview how you can actually visualize the thing corresponding to reinforcement learning. The horse is an agent that is being exposed to the environment while the state is are the jockey's instructions. Action, action is done by the agent and that is jump or run. After jump, if horse get horse successfully pass the obstacle, it get reward or it or else it get penalty. The policy is the strategy of choosing an action given in a state of expectation to become better out. Now, let me also oh, let me also uh, tell you some basic things about the reinforcement learning. Let me write it down because uh, it is really important. Being greedy doesn't always work, and the sequence matters in reinforcement learning. You know how the sequence is processing okay if successfully keeps on passing the obstacle it will finally win the race okay not after each obstacle it win a race you know for the future better outcome so reinforcement learning is the science of making optimal decision using experience process you know there are some process enforcement learning observation of the environment deciding how to get using some strategy action accordingly receiving reward and penalty learning from the experience and, and reinforcement learning over the strategy and later until the optimal strategy is found it keeps on learning so let's move with example and meanwhile i'll give you some theoretical analysis in between the program okay so here 
at the very first you need to import or install the gym environment you can install it by pip install gym environment and i'm taking an example of taxi and that's uh, and uh, today what you will learn at the end of this video that how you can teach your taxi to pick and drop off the passenger from right location okay here we start about the practical implementation i'm using open gym environment and uh, what this environment contain let me give you an overview of this thing also uh, the taxi environment for open ai gym gym you can assume it a smart cap uh, assume you uh, a smart cap is only a vehicle in this parking lot and these are this is the parking lot and we can break the parking lot in 5 by 5 grid and each grid which uh, gives you give a, give us 25 possible taxi location you know we divided it into 5 by 5 grid and these 25 location are one part of a state space okay and notice the current location of taxi is coordinate is any coordinates and in, in this case the uh, as you can see the current state of taxi is six six coordinate okay you will be able to notice that uh, there are four location r g b and y so we can notify these location by 00, zero uh, this one the, this one is 04 this one is 40 and this one is 43 state okay these are the possible location where passenger is being dropped and also i want you to uh, focus that the uh, additional passenger state is being inside the taxi we can take all combination of passenger location and destination location to come to a total number of state for a taxi so there are four destinations where the passenger can be dropped and additional passenger which is which can be inside the taxi so that means to uh, these uh, this is this will fall in five so let's say how many total states are possible so as you know initially the grid size is five by five that means five multiplied by five is 25 which is further multiplied by five the all possible taxi location and there are total four location where the passenger is being dropped so this is stand for five multiplied by five multiplied by five multiplied by four so total state discrete state can be possible is 500 i'm showing here let's move further and um, yeah I, I would like you to understand the action uh, just like i was giving you an example of force either the action can be over either jump or run so the, there was two actions and in this case there are six possible actions the taxi can move south taxi can move north taxi can move east taxi can move west taxi can pick taxi can drop so these are the five action state which are which is showing here so these six state are south north east west pick up and drop and this action space set all action that our agent can take in the given state okay so let's move for further and let's see any state and find find out what coordinates it contain and how it's look like so let me print any state first so this is the 2328th state and the and the states total state contain 500 and this is one of the state where the when the taxi are in row 3 column 1 this is the this is third row first column okay passenger index is 2 and destination index is 0 because no nobody has reached in the destination i can show you all possible state containing in the in the environment by printing you can give get this file or github okay so these are all possible 500 state available and each state containing four variable guys we were at, at at this point where i was explaining you the action space south north east west pick and drop and then we can encode any state by encoding it using the environment taxi rows taxi column passenger index and destination index by running it and you can see that this particular state is is containing in uh, at state number 328.